I have learned so much about me again uh, in 2019 and I'm so so grateful for that. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. It is 2020. Today I want to talk about with you a little bit more about uh, how was for me uh, 2019 and what have, uh, have I learned and what I will be focusing on in 2020. So I have here some mine notes that I have written so I don't get uh, off the track uh, too much. First I want to say I'm so grateful for uh, 2019 because this is a year, this was a year when I decided that I will be focusing on myself and I want to be uh, selfish because all years before I was always thinking about oh if I do this uh, how will that affect somebody else and I didn't do much for myself I always kind of way um, looking for excuses when uh, I was afra afraid of, of something or like oh no this might be hurting this pe person or somebody else and I don't want to do it but 2019 was for me <laughs> all about me being selfish and uh, get into the healthy habits uh, in case you are following me for a while you know I have started uh, this yeah like exact one year from uh, now I have started my fitness journey for the from the 12 months I was like I was eight to ten months was in the gym actually three times a week and I have uh, managed to incorporate it uh, with my full-time job with my side uh, sides project uh, because I, I love to do multiple things <laughs> uh, in on the same time so I have learned so much about me again uh, in 2019 and I'm so so grateful for that sometimes we need to be selfish to rediscover ourselves again because for example for me I was totally off my track I didn't have the healthy lifestyle in 2019 I wanted to update my lifestyle because it it wasn't the healthy one and it wasn't the one that I wanted for myself decided that it's it is okay for me for one year to be selfish and to see w where am i uh, on which point and uh, from where i need to uh, start work working on myself so um, if you follow me for a while uh, you will know that each year i give myself like one may, main focus focus point and then I just follow this point and I build my goals around this so when I have turned my lifestyle upside down I wanted to like rediscover myself my needs all over again and I'm so grateful that I have done it because I rediscovered <laughs> what I need in my life again and what I need to focus on. Um, I'm the type of person that loves to create and uh, I wanted to for a while uh, bought the new camera and I have upgraded uh, from DSLR to mirrorless camera and um, th this is huge huge for me. Um, I have started picking uh, picking the camera more up and creating um, the memories. I have also opened my new Instagram account uh, where I will post and where I am posting just uh, my photos and like what I think the, the the best of. And for now, I'm I'm excited f for it and. Uh, it's going somewhere 
and with my fitness journey I am so excited that I have managed to like train my mind and body that this is the place for me uh, when I'm not when I'm anxious when um, I don't know what to do with myself that I need to do, to go just I will be fine um, like the outcome of the negative energy and for 2020 more plan to focus on my weight loss and um, my workout for me on this year because when last year I have said I just want to I, I'm I'm not expecting of myself to lose a ton of weight I don't expect to be like <laughs> fit uh, at the end of the year I just expect for me to have a habit of going into the gym at the end of the 2019 I got the chance to work on two side projects um, I don't know how many of you know this or if I have tell you before I think I am in, su in some of my blog posts uh, but when I was in elementary school I have done like themes um, for blogs <laughs> uh, where in that time uh, you need to know just HTML and <laughs> the website is just was HTML so simple and uh, I got a chance to uh, at the end of uh, 2019 to do side to side projects for a website and I love it I have so much good time doing the these websites uh, and like explore more about it and learn more so I'm hoping that soon I will have more projects like this so I can say this last year was a year of learning and incorporate the things that I already love into my daily routine to make more healthier lifestyle and like selfish year <laughs> doing what I love to do so uh, this was my best decision in 2019 when um, I have started and I was in like for a couple of years back um, like always back and forth with uh, bad habits so I'm glad I have managed to do this. New 2020, my focus point will be like try to do more side work, uh, side projects and mm, be more creative. Like 2020 for me is turn impossible to impossible. So I'm hoping you, you are uh, liking this video. Thank you so much. Uh, we will see us in the uh, next video and have a nice day. Bye!